So the prescriptive R value table of the energy code talks about the U value and solar heat gain coefficient of the windows that are installed on the house. Uh, in my climate zone here in climate zone five in Colorado, it says that you have to have a U value of 0 0.30 and a solar heat gain coefficient of 0 0.40. And you can see where these labels become very important uh, from an inspection perspective and also from a verification and an insurance that the builder is meeting the intent of the code here. Uh, this particular window is showing that the U factor is a 0 0.31 window, uh, which means that uh, doesn't necessarily mean that they're not in compliance with the code because uh, they could be using a performance pathway of the code, but also in the prescriptive pathway of the code, you can use a weighted R value or weighted U value approach uh, to the, the window U value of all the windows in this house. So they might be uh, doing that as well. The solar heat gain coefficient is also listed on the label. And in this case, it's a 0.30 uh, in, in this case. And then it's also showing us the visible air, uh, the visible transmittance, which is telling us how much of the light that's coming through uh, that window is visible to our naked eye uh, to help the ambience of this house. And it, lastly, it talks about the air leakage uh, rate of that window unit. Now, the National Fenestration Rating Council is the one that does the ratings of these windows. Manufacturers send that window unit to uh, the NFRC to rate the window, and then these labels are installed on the windows that are being delivered to the house here. It's important to keep those labels on the house until the rough inspections are complete uh, so that the code jurisdiction can inspect and ensure that the windows that are installed are meeting the requirements of the energy code or more specifically the requirements of the compliance pathway that the builder is using through the energy code. So the builder might be using a performance compliance pathway that might be taking advantage of lower U-value windows or uh, more insulation for higher uh, U-value windows in that trade-off uh, approach that is allowed in the performance pass in the code.